34 years old. I've been doing CrossFit for about four years, since 2012. All right, so you know what's next. How did how you did, start? How did I start? Uh, my wife, uh, her coworker, his nephew was opening a gym and she did the legal work, so that's how we started off. Mm -hmm. So they roped you into it that way? Yeah, yeah, cool. for sure. Um, so like, what, what were you doing before you started CrossFit? Just global gym stuff. Um, I had noticed uh, CrossFit workouts online before uh, and I tried a couple and just like everyone else who, who does it now, once you start, you're addicted, so yeah. yeah. So you played collegiate soccer? Yes. And then a little professional? A little professional, yeah. Um, so like having that, do you think like CrossFit helped fill like your competitive edge at all? For sure. For sure, even when the year I played that semi-pro, I kind of came out of retirement, so I was, I was itching to do something. So, um, you know, just global gym was getting boring and filled that void for sure, right away. Right on. Um, so, like, when you first started to now, what kind of changes have you seen in yourself? Uh, everything. <laughs> um, everything from, you know, personal conference, or uh, confidence to, um, you know, just my body composition. Um, about a year and a half ago, I started with Kate, and, uh, <laughs> completely changed my diet and it's been awesome. Yeah. So So like well, what you wait you started like what? You I was two twenty when I started with Kate and I'm a buck eighty seven as of this morning. Moving some good so, weight too. Yeah, yeah. So and at thirty four I can't complain. <laughs> so Um so what's something you wish you knew when you started CrossFit? Um I wish I like did more. Like my sister's a gymnast and now I'm like I wish I would have got into that. Um it would have definitely paid off yeah. in the beginning. Um, I wish I just knew more about like overall nutrition and and uh, working out. To be honest, just a regular meathead when I was at the global. Yeah. yeah. What are your aspirations as you progress? I am right now. I'm my uh, the ultimate goal is uh, the games is a Masters 35, 39 in 2018. So I got a little bit um, for this year. Uh, just improve off of my open uh, results last year. I was uh, around 350, just if I could cut that in half, yeah. which is what I've pretty much been doing every year. Um, I'd be happy with that, and if I so happen to, to make it to a Grandview team or as an alternate, uh, I'd be lucky I'd, to have you, man. So for people who are starting CrossFit or looking to get started, um, what's a piece of advice you could give them as they start to come in here? Just do it. You'll get addicted. The pain is very addicting, um, <coughs> surprisingly. So it's, you just gotta try it. You know, it's uh, it's the the family at the gym that really um, that makes it worthwhile. You know, everyone's cheering everyone on, and just enthusiastic. You yeah. know, and once you the you know you, you're doing things that you don't think you could ever do. Uh, you know, handstand walks, muscle ups, things like that. Like you try it, you may fail a couple times, but you know you keep at it, you'll, you'll get it, and you'll want more of that. Chris Sinsel, round two. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah. Cool.